upon it, Jesus Christ brought to completion the sacrament of his love for the church. As we bow before the cross, let us remember that in his own blood, Christ has removed all divisions and out of the many nations created the one people of God. As we venerate the cross, let us reflect that we are ourselves Christ's disciples and must therefore follow him, willingly taking up our own cross each day. Mighty Father, your Son reconciled us to you by suffering on the cross and then returned to you in glory. May your people who gaze upon this cross see in it a sign of redemption, find in it protection and strength, and may we shoulder our own crosses in the spirit of the gospel, in the spirit of Christ, until our earthly journey ends. Lord God, Holy Father, you will the cross of your Son to be the fountain of all blessings, the source of all grace. In your goodness, be near to us on our journey of life. May we always hold fast the mystery of Christ's suffering and so enter the joy of his risen life, who is Lord for ever and ever. Amen. Amen. Lord be with you. And with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you, protect you, and guide you. May you always live your lives rooted in the love and power of the cross, which is the sign of God's love for us. We ask for this blessing, this inspiration, this protection upon you in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Well done all of you. Very proud. See you Friday. See you Friday.